What's up, y'all? It's Stacey Nation. We back with another reaction video. And today, y'all, we got Breelin. Braylon? Braylon. I don't know how I fucked it up. Braylon, the voice you didn't know you needed, but now you do. I've never heard of this young man, <laughs> but one of y'all requested him, so we are going to react to him on the uh, Terrell show. So make sure you hit that like button. Make sure you uh, subscribe. Follow us on all of our socials. They are up on the screen now, including our TikTok, which I got to add on there. And that, you know what? Fuck it. Let's get into the video, y'all. Don't touch my truck. One more time. Don't touch my truck. This you know what I'm saying? Just, this is not look, luck. It's this not is luck. Not, it's this truck. Is <laughs> <laughs> it's not luck. It's Everybody, it's your boy Terrell. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here today. Yeah. He came here on his truck, y'all. <laughs> Breland is in the building today. What's Give up? it up for my boy Breland. What's poppin'? Welcome to the show, man. Good to be here, man. It only took me like good four years. What you talking about, Willis? Man, I was trying to get on here since like the very first couple episodes. I peeped at somebody was like, oh, check this out. It's where the singers go. I was what? like, I'm a singer. And I reached out like way back. You won't see it because I had to unsend it once oh! we started talking. I had to unsend it. I had to, <laughs> <laughs> you unsend I had to unsend it to back me. in like 2018. I, I was I'm I slid. Dead. I slid pretty aggressively. I was like, hey, hi, I'm Breland. And um, I would love I to be on your show. It. And you well. I was right the first time. It's Breland. Yeah. Not Brayland. So don't come for me. You just never yeah, you know. You never saw it. You really don't you never don't. know. You don't. Uh, <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Damn it. I'm hurt. I'm, so... I'm hurt. But you're hit now. No, no, I'm here. This, it, this wow. couldn't have been a better time for me to be here, honestly. I didn't have much going on at the time that I was trying to come on here, so. Well, you got a lot going on now, sir. Uh, a little son, son. All my favorite singers have been on the show. Who? You had my boy Kevin Ross on the show. I did. I've written with Kevin I Ross. Love. You've had Avery on the show. Of course. Tell me this. Look, Multiple check this times. out. Check this out. What happened? Avery Wilson and I uh -huh. were born on the same day, same year. Y'all the exact same July 18th, 1995, God said, copy paste. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Freeland, there are so many facts on this card, sir. Well, we I got... don't even know. We... I love his personality. Like, yeah. you know, he ain't scared to talk. You yeah, know what I'm saying? A lot of a lot of people who come on the Terrell show, they only talk when Terrell talks to them. I love yeah. that he takes the initiative to say something first yeah if he feel like to have the conversation yeah we're gonna get through them all let's start from where you're from okay born in jersey shout out to jersey <laughs> what's up garden state what's up garden state yeah we repping hardly home but always repping <laughs> <laughs> y'all may have seen my family because they be going viral low-key my my sister and my parents bt a lot of people were posting them and everybody was tagging me a couple yes. weeks ago like hey ain't this your fam and i was like Dang, it is. <laughs> like, I'm like, they going so out without me, you man. You come it's... from a musical family. Yeah, they all sing. Everybody in your family sing? They all sing, and they're nice. Like, they're cold. <laughs> okay, so clearly like, that's where you got your start from. For sure. Now, were you the last person to get your singing chops I was, or the first? What I happened? was the last for sure. I was yeah. like, they were almost like, man, like, is he ever going to get it? Is you he going to catch on? <laughs> is he going to find his Yeah, notes? I was like, yes, you sir. grew up. I look at you on the Terrell show. Okay listening to gospel music okay yep. so did you also grow up in the church i'm assuming of course tell me about your church and and what kind of church was it did yeah. it let you wear your earrings that dangle uh i got these <laughs> later in life okay i think um, that was a personal choice <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> my parents are both ordained ministers they both um Ooh. they lead worship uh Ooh, at... imagine having two ministers <laughs> i can't imagine having one y'all no offense to the the minister the children the preacher kid you know none of y'all but yeah man just i guess it just depends on what your parents you know believe in when it comes to raising yeah. their children you know what i'm saying because mm -hmm. we've all heard of the preacher kid who can't do nothing i went to school with a preacher kid and 
his parents would send him to school basically dressed like he was going to church almost. And he would go and change in the bathroom. I would too. He would go and change in the bathroom. You know, so we all heard of that preacher's kid who had to kind of sneak around and do stuff. But you'll be surprised of the preacher kid and the minister. Let me turn myself down because I just peaked a little bit. You'll be surprised of the preacher kid and the minister kid and, you know, the kids of the church um, who parents believe in freedom lenient, yeah you know what i'm saying like letting their children learn learn grow from their mistakes and mm-hmm. you know like warning them but not just trying to protect them or keep them from every little thing yeah you know what i'm saying so i, I guess it just depends on the parents because you got parents who aren't in the church at all aren't ministers aren't preachers aren't bishops don't go to church at all and they do their kid the same way as yeah. some of them do you know what i'm saying so it's just you know i don't know i guess it just depend on the parent mm-hmm. at our church the household so we had beliefs. no choice no we had we had no choice really we have a lot to talk about we okay. do we got a lot I'm to get so to. excited we got a lot we're to gonna get be to. here all night long yeah. if you ain't got your drink yet please go get your drink if Come you're under 21 i hear apple juice is tasty um <laughs> i'm gonna start this game <laughs> okay? let's get it let's get it you might know the rules Okay. Because you've been trying to get on here for a year. I'm trying to get on here forever. I've been studying the dictionary. Trying to get... So you're probably going to get a perfect score because no, you've had lots know. of practice. Uh, I don't know. Well, okay. We'll you see. You set the expectations. Your first word <laughs> on this card. 11 seconds. So it's on the clock. Okay. Did he just get really focused? Did you see that? You see yep. I was like... <laughs> 11 seconds. The word okay. is wish. Go. Wish. Mm-hmm. Um, 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 um. I wish, I wish upon a star that fell up with a clouds of fire behind me. So, oh, you better sing yeah. Ooh, his voice is very distinctive. Is that the word? Maybe. Like it, like it, it's in his own. Like his voice is different. Yeah, you know, that's, that's, like the sound. Yeah, that's you know that's, what I'm that's why I'm, I'm listening. And I'm like, let me listen more. Yeah, because I've not. Is that is that your different. way of telling me to press play? Talking about let me listen more. No, but yeah, oh, okay. I need to listen more. <laughs> I know, but it's just it just caught me because it's a lot of people who sing in voices different from their uh regular voice. Yeah. But I wasn't expecting his singing voice to be like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's just different. <laughs> I see. I don't know the words somewhere with the rainbow, but you know it's one of those. They give me, say give wish me, in there. Give me the, no, you got the point. They say wish. Give me the chorus of the song somewhere. Uh, it's somewhere over the rainbow, way up high. What happens up there? There's a there's a land land free land that <laughs> I heard of once <laughs> in a lullaby. I just love it. Yes, come I don't on. know the words to a lot of songs, but I do know that they say wish <laughs> in that song. They say wish. No, you got the point. I'm just, yeah, I'm just they say looking wish. at you in yeah, awe. They say wish. Because I just think you're amazing. Thank you. Already. It's mutual. No. <laughs> it's mutual. It goes both ways. He's never leaving. The word is again. Hmm. See, but what you got in again that you got in mind? Okay, 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 okay. Come on uh, now. Uh, uh. Oh no, don't do this to me. Oh. No, don't do it because it's oh, 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 oh. I mean, you're going to have to try again. We call oh. it. Oh, that's a good one. Try again, mm. try again, try again. Yeah. Uh, at first, you don't succeed. Oh, hey. Come on. Okay. I, I was late. I was up. like, try again. Uh. I was late. I'm sorry. Was that the buzzer? That was the buzzer. <laughs> what if you just start the clock like two seconds after? You, you still it. have a buzzer because you took too long for oh, that. Oh my too. goodness! Yeah. Together is the word. Eleven seconds. Okay. Okay. Together. Together. Come together. on, Disney Channel. Um, um. 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 I know you used to watch High School Musical. Uh. Oh my God! I gosh, know you used to watch High School happening? Musical. And there's a whole lot of more songs that say together. But when I hear the word together, that is the first song that come to mind. First song that comes to my mind when I hear the word together was a song off of the movie Grease. Okay, hold on, hold on, together. Uh, How was this too buzzed? Did y'all buzzer me? (laughs) Oh, I know I ain't get buzzered on together. I'm not. I'm not happy with the quality of this. That works. See, see, 
See? High School Musical was after I had left the Disney yeah, Channel you're old. stage. You're old. You're yeah. like in your 30s. I'm still in my 20s. First of all, <laughs> you're right. Y'all not old. Y'all y'all not old, but y'all older. You know what I'm saying? You're I'm older seasoned. than me. You feel me? Mm, yeah. And Those he said facts. he was born in 1995. That's why I feel like he should have he should have said that off top. Yeah. Words. Now now look, we got the buzzer now. All in this together. I'm upset. Come on. I love High School Musical. I love High School Musical. You know what I'm saying? We're soaring, flying. There's not a star in. Come on, finish me. Finish it. Heaven that we can't reach. Can't reach. (laughs) (laughs) Then we're breaking free. That's not the same song as Together, but is that the same song? No. It's a different song? There is no way that you can exist this way. That's a different song? No, that's the same song. And if it's different, that's not the same song. It's my show. It's the same song. It's the same song today. Today, today those are the same song. Oh, those those are two different songs. (laughs) Today, those are the same song, Terrell. You just told me I had a green light You mixed up All In Together and The Sword and Flying. They're two different songs. Yeah, one of them that was on the basketball court, the other one that was on the stage with the moves and the stalls. That's basically the same song. Same movie. It's the same movie. So that that's what we were we saying. We feel it. Sorry, Vanessa and oh, Troy. Man. I meant Vanessa and um, what's his name? Troy. Troy. Burn. Burn. Okay. Um, we can hit a little uh let it burn. A little Usher. Or we can hit um that Jasmine Sullivan. Either burn. one. Uh that Jasmine Sullivan is like uh 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 um what's You it? feel that fire. Yeah. You feel that fire. Oh Woo. yeah. Just let it burn. Ah. There's no warning. Just take your time. <laughs> I'm making up the words yes, right now, are. am I? But they were very <laughs> close. crazy, but I think I found the love of my life. That's yeah. Right. Uh, yeah. I felt the warmth of the call the night. Did I fire? <laughs> Go ahead. Let it burn. Mm. There's no warning. I'm making that part up. There's is no that running. Running. running, that's what it when is. When it's your turn. When it's your turn. Just let it burn. Just let it burn. Say it again. Just let it burn. What you gonna do? There's no running. <laughs> is that not it? <laughs> it's remixes. Hey, man. I, so I said it's four bars, and you I'm gonna double it. That's songwriting 101, OK? I take creative license. As a songwriter, all right, you know, and that's a Grammy nominated song. Yeah. So <laughs> it's really just my own cover. It's a remix. Have it's a sex. remix. That's a brilliant it's a remix. remix. It's a remix. Have it's you used remix. that before? I haven't. That is fantastic. It. That's off top. It is now yours. It's proprietary, so it's <laughs> that's me. <laughs> Speaking of songwriting, y'all, Breland, he, his nickname, um, was it Point Guard? Pin the pinpoint guard. guard. The, the pinpoint pin guard. guard, yes. This man be writing, y'all. I got it somewhere on the card I saw who you've been writing for. Uh, for for Trey Songs. Uh-huh. Ty Dolla mm. Sign. Yes. John Legend. Pink Sweat. Did you hear what I hear? No. You heard the same name that I heard? Oh, yes, I did hear those names. I did. Did you hear John Legend? I did hear. I definitely heard that. Trey Songs, whoever else he Ty said. Dollar sign. Trey Songs and whoever else he said. John Legend. And John Legend. You've been writing for the GOAT? Okay, okay. That's fire. How old are you? 95. Oh, so he's the same, he's the same age as me. Uh, he's actually else? younger than me. Mm. Yeah, that is... so that means he's 27 right now. Hmm. Yes. Okay. Doing a lot with your life, more than I did at 27. Yeah, I've probably more written and recorded well over 3,000 songs over the last, like, six years. 3,000 songs? <laughs> 3,000 songs. That's a lot of music, It is a lot of sir. music. So tell me about your songwriting process, because with it being so fast, there yeah. must be a secret. There is a secret. Here's yes. the secret, okay? I I think of melodies first. It's usually the first melody that comes to you is going to probably be the chorus. Be the one. People will, like, double like second guess themselves to a yeah. point where they don't even have any of their original melodies. There's a reason why those melodies came to you first. It's mm. because it's what's supposed to be there. Mm. More times than not. I don't second guess myself. The first yeah. melody that comes to my head, I'm like, this is probably it. I go with it. And then I just start figuring out what the concept is. Tell the audience and me some songs mm. that yeah. we'd be surprised that you wrote on. Mm. I wrote uh, I wrote Right Now by Trevor Jackson. Yeah, yeah. That was the first one that I wrote. That was like the first cut that I ever had. He's so good here. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was on here. That's when I was trying to get on. I see. It was around there. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh, snap. <laughs> I did nine songs on the Trey Songs album. The Back Home album on that just came out. Album. Was it last yeah. year? Yep, yep. In wow. the fall. Last fall. Uh, I wrote nine of those songs. Now, how do you get nine placements on the same person's album? Well, once we had a couple, it was just like we were locked in. So he's like, you know the sound that I'm yes. going for. I mean, it's everything comes down to relationships. That's you know? true. Do me a favor. Mm -hmm. Sing your favorite song that you wrote for Trey's album. Tell me if you love. Uh, then I'ma find a way around. Uh, Ooh. And turn it lost into a found. Oh yeah, baby, if you love. I'ma find my way around. Uh, yeah. And turn that lost into a fire. That what? sounds like something Trey Song yes, is out here singing. Definitely. That sounds like something. Definitely. Now I want to go hear him sing. Exactly. Because that sound like, that literally sounds like That's something his that vibe. Trey Song. That is You his definitely vibe. knew his vibe. No wonder you wrote nine of his songs. Okay. There probably was only 10 songs on there. You wrote all of them. <laughs> Trey Songs probably wrote the intro. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> oh. It's a little, little something yes. like that. Yes. Yeah. Really if your loving was a fountain. Uh, <laughs> oh, well, too. Yes. Uh, and I would drink that water down. That sounds uh, like something Trey would oh, say. Right. <laughs> exactly. Uh, he, <laughs> said, he said, <laughs> if your kisses were the liquor. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> then I'd be drunk enough to drown. You are on your way. I hope so. I mean, you're already you you're down? already here. Huh? I was asking if you want me to bring the light down or something. No, yeah, I'm sorry if I keep looking off. <laughs> this is our lighting is not being our good lighting. To us today. I'm not satisfied with our lighting and how we look on the screen. We may look fine to y'all, <laughs> but this is not what you know we shoot we aim for you know some what I'm days saying? our lighting is very good and some, and days, some days we like don't today. know what's going on you know <laughs> but i think it's this cheap ring light that we're gonna have to upgrade yeah probably. you know what i'm saying <laughs> every time we fix something something else decides it wants to <sighs> story of our youtube lives <laughs> okay you sure you want to be a youtuber <laughs> But, but I'm on my way. This is the start. This way. is the exactly. beginning. These people are like, I don't know this man. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Help. The word yeah. is son, and that's S O N. Oh, S O N. Yes. <clears throat> uh, okay, okay, okay. Uh, there's a gospel song probably somewhere. <laughs> son, not probably. Son of God. He's the son of the living God. <laughs> He's a son of God. I'm making, it up. Up. <laughs> I'm making it up. <laughs> Not me making it up. Dang. He's the son of the living God. Make it up. Go ahead. Keep Ooh, going. He's a writer. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. I said, uh, mm. I said that we worship. Hallelujah. Uh, raise your hands and worship. Cause he's a son of the living God. Ah uh. Uh. <laughs> oh, uh, 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 uh. Rants. Rants. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> S U N. What would you sing? That we would have done. Um, I ain't never gonna shut you out. Everywhere I'm looking now, I'm surrounded by your embrace. Baby, I can feel your halo. You better shut up. My saving grace. No, no, keep going. Everything I'm sorry. I need I and more is written all over your face. Baby, I can feel your halo. Ah. Pray it won't fade away. Yeah. Yeah, clap for that, please. That was really good for that's me. S, that's S, that's S U N, all right? But, but that's like, you know, S O N. Come on, homo I'm phones. I'm a. <laughs> Brie, we're gonna play a game within a game, mm -hmm. okay? I'm making this up as I go. This is not on the card. I don't know why I'm looking at that's it. That's usually. Put it down. <laughs> Put it down and look at the camera. I want you to write something on the spot. Now, y'all can't steal this mm. because. This is here. It's here, okay? This is so here. let this live here. We're all gonna right? split the publishing. No. <laughs> together. We gotta work that out ahead of time so we don't have any disputes on the back end. <laughs> he's been around. I've done this. I've he's, done he's, this. He's people, not a new Because then all of a sudden Roxy's gonna be like, I actually wrote that song. Yes. And I'm gonna be like, no, no, you didn't, Roxy. I gave you the melody for the pre yes, you're gonna the pre be like, Well, I brought you in and therefore I deserve 10%. That's music industry. I'm not here for it, Roxy. Stop trying to take my pub. Okay? It's so this, real though. This is between 
between me and Terrell, okay? I'm going to give you a word. Well, we and got you it. have got to, I'm actually going to choose the word from this list, okay? Mm. So make up the song. It cannot be a real song, mm -hmm. okay? Let's use the word goodbye. Mm -hmm. Goodbye. Goodbye. <clears throat> There's nothing good in goodbye. There's nothing good in farewell. So when you say that you tried, I know it didn't go well. I know I just said that twice, but I ain't Miss Adele. So I don't say hello. I just say go to hell. Go, 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 go. <laughs> oh, go. Come on. That's off top. Baby, I gotta lower you because you you just <laughs> peaked like hell when you was laughing. <laughs> Listen, man. Uh he if he if he didn't turn that into a song when he left there. That yeah. needed to be a song. Cause Definitely. I would listen to that. That was nice. Mm -hmm. God damn oh. That's us. That's us. That's all us. So you see Roxy over there trying to write it down. Roxy, stop. She trying to write it down. She's trying to steal my... Oh, come on, dog. Girl. Don't do me like that. You better... Uh, when you be clap for that, I'm sorry. That's talent right there. Okay. A little song off top, okay? This is why you people calling you. Yeah, this I'm is why quick. people are calling I'll trying, you. I be trying to be quick. The word is truck. Uh. Don't touch my truck. Don't touch my truck. He trying to get slapped. And I'll do it for you again. Don't touch my truck. One more time. Don't touch my truck. He said, you know what I'm saying? This is not look, luck. It's this not is luck. Not, it's truck. <laughs> <laughs> it's not luck. It's truck. We'll throw you out of here. That's, anyway. that's in the song. That's Congratulations the song. for the song going. Did you say platinum? I say a platinum. Sir. Yes, sir. What kind of, when did that happen? When did you get the news? Uh, I got it back in January. And the song had been out for a year and it was pretty exciting. There's only a handful of folk who get to say that. There's only a handful of folk who get to say that off of their debut single. Debut too. Off the single. debut. Off the debut. How does that feel? It's pretty exciting. And it's your own. And it's my own. Tell me about Breland, uh, let's say two, three years ago. <laughs> and, here, and here we are now. So give me the yeah. difference between the two. What's happened? Three years ago, I was working a corporate day job, suit and tie vibes, selling technology <laughs> to businesses. I moved to Atlanta with- You turned around and looked back. Do I need to be looking no, back look too? I back because out my peripheral, I keep seeing look like the light move changing. Oh, but I forgot the TV, TV is on, on. <laughs> yeah. I forgot to turn it on. I'm sitting here like, the hell we looking at shit the warning niggas you just gonna sit there look back and then look back at the screen like you didn't just look back like if it was an emergency we would i would have told you if it was an gone. emergency i would already be dead because i'm on i'm i got you covered bless you lord this green screen gotta go because i can't see <laughs> The dollar in a dream, and I I, it was, I just took the first job that I got yes. out of college, and it was that. I would go to work. I would be at work from 8.30 to 6, uh -huh. and then I would be at the studio from 6.30 to 3. You better talk about and it And then I here. would get home at 3.30. I would have to be up at 7.30 for work, so I was on a 19-hour day every day. I, I never took to a break. I listen to this. You better speak in here. This is what it, this is what it was. You had your nine to five or yeah. eight thirty to six. Eight thirty to six to sustain your life mm -hmm. while you went out there and went for yours. Exactly. And exactly. it was probably the hardest time of your life. It was impossible, but it was very possible because all things are possible. All right, we preaching. We're Christ preaching Christ. in here, okay? Christ Act like I got some us. sense, okay? The whiskey got me right. <laughs> <laughs> I might get drunk on Saturday, but first thing Sunday morning, I praise the Lord. Yes, sir. Absolutely. <laughs> Sunday's in a couple of hours, and I'll be ready. And we'll, okay. we'll be ready. But, but yeah, now. like that—that that process was—it was just my way of saying, look, I know that I'm not gonna be able to make it in music if I'm not putting in the hours. Yes. And the truth is, as a young songwriter, mm -hmm. you actually have to be better 
you have to write a better song than the established songwriters because the established songwriters get the benefit of the doubt. Absolutely. And the established songwriters have relationships with the artist. Yes. Right? So if someone like, I don't know, if Beyonce is looking for a song and she has hits with Neo, yeah. and Neo sends her a song, yeah. she's going to rock with that song probably a little extra because they're friends. Yes. Right? But if I try to send a song to Beyonce's camp and she doesn't know me from a can of paint, mm. she's going to be like, not really that interested in it. So that's or really smart. I have to write a better song right. than everyone else who's already established as a new writer. That's why it's so difficult to get your foot in the door as a mm. songwriter is because you have to actually outperform everybody who has first mover advantage. I think for, for all of the people out there who, who do write songs and mm -hmm. want to make it into the music industry, you have to put in the time. Like when they say 10,000 hours makes yeah. you an expert or a master at something, that's real. If you don't take that time, if you achieve that success, it's going to be premature. Let me tell you something. That's with anything. That's with anything. Anything outside of a nine to five that has to do with a dream. That stands with anything. You know what I'm saying? Like it's morning, it's nights when me and baby don't go to sleep. We don't get done record reacting until almost two o'clock in the morning. Then we got to turn around and get up about seven in the morning. And then about six, seven o'clock, sometimes later, we back reacting again, trying to get these videos down. It's a nonstop job. Chasing a dream is a nonstop job. You know what I'm saying? And doing that and staying consistent with us is what has gotten us where we are now in three months. Yeah. What? We've been reacting for three months. We reached a thousand subscribers within one month yeah. by staying consistent and working even when we was tired, even when we didn't want to. And it was tough. It was tough, man. It seen was tough. Videos of us sitting up here, and, and we looked like looked we was like we gone. Dead. We was tired. We but was. We was. We was tired as hell. It's the. It's the it's it's the it's what's at the finish line that keep you going. Yeah, you got on the other side is the motivation to keep going. So that's that's you, the it's all gonna be worth it in the end. Yeah, you definitely have to, you know what I'm saying, remind yourself of why. The purpose. Your why has to be on your mm -hmm. mind every second of the moment that you are doing what it is you have to do to pursue what you're trying to pursue yep. that why has to be you need to tattoo that at the at the very most important part of your brain mm -hmm. because that's the only thing that's gonna help you get through because yep. it was so many times where we was like we didn't want to react we we was tired we didn't want to do it but we knew we had to do it because that's what we signed up for and that's just what you got to do and when Sometimes, baby say it was times that that don't mean that it was times way back when we first we still have some oh we still time. have times we still have we still time. have times <laughs> but we, we we're a little bit more established where we can miss mm -hmm. a day or we can miss two days it's, it's been times we missed a week but it wasn't we didn't miss a week because we wanted to miss a week y'all we be we be having if y'all knew what we have going on outside of doing this y'all would be like i don't even know how y'all do it exactly <laughs> like seriously it's so much going on on the other side of this camera. Like it's crazy. Yeah. And days like today, I almost was like, you know what, babe, we ain't recording today. But then I had to think of what we got to do tomorrow. So we got to record today because we also got to record tomorrow. So it's just, y'all, you just, it's, 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 it's a battle with anything. It's not just YouTube. You know what I'm saying? I could be talking to a painter. I could be talking to a singer, uh, 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 violinist, any damn body. You know what I'm saying? This goes for anybody. You Whatever chasing a dream? dream is. You chasing a dream, man? You gotta work. You gotta work when you're tired. You gotta work when you don't want to work. You gotta work mm -hmm. when you're trying to go out and have fun. I don't know the last time me and baby went out to have fun. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Be because we be right here. <laughs> we be right here mm -hmm. trying to trying to get to the point that we see in our mind. It's We're trying to reach picture. our why. The bigger picture. Because when we reach our why, when we reach our purpose, it's going to be plenty of time to party and do all of that. And yeah. Do, and, and, 
and to really bask in that. Yes. See, when we get to that point, we want to get to the point where we could sit and really be like, <sighs> yes. this is it. This what all that was for. This was yep. all that for all that frustration wanting to knock shit over. Okay, because y'all <sighs> she was almost there. <laughs> Today? Today has sent me over the edge. <laughs> is it still out the Ooh, it's eleven eleven. Mm. And we've been catching We've them. been catching these numbers like crazy, y'all. Today has sent me over the edge. Y'all, I can't even explain to y'all. <laughs> we fixed the static in the mics. Now the camera want to have a shortage. Y'all, this camera almost went across the room. Y'all wasn't going to get no reaction for a couple of days. Maybe longer. <laughs> Maybe longer. Because <laughs> this camera almost went to the other side. That wall on the other side of the room. This camera was about to hit that. Because I was ready to throw it. Just don't um, remember the why. That why I'm telling you that why is the only thing keeping me sane. All right. Sorry, we kind of dragged that out, but somebody needed to Oops. hear that. And if it wasn't you, that don't mean it wasn't meant for somebody else. Stop typing. Keep watching. Let's go. My mm. biggest, my biggest prayer throughout all of this was that I didn't achieve anything too early. Mm. I didn't mm. want to achieve anything too early. I said, look. Mm. Everything Ooh, needs to be the in the right timing there. that it's supposed that to be. Supposed to you be. can you that's can rush something and end up on Ooh, a platform that you don't you actually have the ready. preparation mm. up to stay on. You can't maintain you it. Ready? So I said, "You ever seen somebody get rich quick and Ooh. wonder why they fell off?" Yeah, because they weren't prepared for it. That when I tell you that's a word, and I don't even know. See why y'all tell us about this? Because see, this start the conversation that some of y'all don't be wanting us to have in the midst of these videos. Exactly. But, but one listen, thing we're gonna do is say what we gotta say. That's what that's, that's the whole point of a reaction. And the thing being too is because what we say might be something for somebody else. When I say that, that's a word mm -hmm. because we often sit around and be like. Why haven't we got to, why are we not here? Why are we not there? Yeah. I've been doing this for so long and yeah. I'm still in this place. You're not ready, baby. You're not ready for what you can be blessed to have at that point yeah. in time in your life. And I have those moments a lot. That is the thing. Cause I think, I think that way too. Like darn, like we be working hard. We do mm -hmm. this and we still here, but you're not ready. It's something yeah. in your life that you have to, that you have to master and fix and rearrange and do differently and then you'll be at that point and a lot of times it has to do with stuff that you have to examine within yourself factual smackual a lot of times your attitude your patience your okay because the god process. is definitely working on my patience right now y'all he is working <laughs> real hard um i used to be a very patient person i don't know what happened you got older i don't the, yeah that sounds about older, right because that's what happened to mine I I used to be patient. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to explain it to you. I'm going to break it down to you real quick. And if you're mad because we talking, I don't give a damn. I don't care. Um, I used to have locks. And everybody know you need locks. You need patience to start locks. A lot of people don't continue their lock journey because they don't have the patience for the ugly stages, mm -hmm. a lot of people call it. The, the foundation stages, Basically. I like to call it. Yeah. I had locks for four years and I started with little tiny little Mac. Now nah, I don't want to say Mac cause it's nasty. Yeah, it uh, is. little, little balls on my head, <laughs> baby. In the last year, how many times did I try to, did I try to retwist, restart my locks? And I just couldn't do it. She went from restarting locks to free low form cut. to low cut, to fade, <laughs> to sponge, to everything and guess where we at now i'm growing my hair back out <laughs> so i can try to start my locks again my patience is ain't there stacy preached to me all the time about my patience she was like god is teaching you to be patient you learning patience and oh today i really learned patience when the people that's a funny thing because when when you are supposed to be learning something the first thing you do when somebody say that that's what you're supposed to be learning is you say i know that i got i got patience I've been working on my patience. It can't be enough because sometimes <laughs> you still get a look like certain stuff. You still, if it still get to you to a, to a point where it can almost have fumes coming out your If it can ruin your, your entire mood, your entire moment. It still has power over you. 
Yes, because it still, it still had power over me. over me today, and I had to knock it out the way <laughs> and say, "Come on, babe, let's do this thing." Before I say, "Fuck it," <laughs> I'm telling you. Now, if you watch the video that was posted at five o'clock, you gonna see my attitude right in the beginning <laughs> of that video. I still had a little attitude in that video, y'all. I try not to let this stuff get to me and then bring it on camera, but sometimes it's really, really hard. But a lot of times. Once we get started reacting, that's what brings me back to, mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? Because it brings me back down. It's like, Asia, yeah. look, this is what this is for. You struggle with that camera for this. You know what I'm saying? You mm -hmm. struggle with that microphone for this. I seen a comment the other day. A lady said, uh, we sound good. Mm -hmm. The quality of our microphone sound good. And we were struggling with our microphone quality for days with our yeah. other microphone that we were using. And reading that comment, I had to tell myself, you struggled with that microphone for this for this mm -hmm. comment right here. Right, you struggled yeah. with that microphone for that. Yep. All them days I was aggravated. I didn't want to react because the sound quality was bad, but we knew we had to keep going. And she a perfectionist, so if something I'm, don't go right or don't look right, she don't. She she she. I'm ready. Y'all see, I keep looking over here at this thing because I don't, I'm not I'm not satisfied with the lighting. Now, if y'all see the next video, the lighting may be different and it may be better, and that's probably it may, it may be worse. I may be done made it worse because <laughs> she finna tweak something on <laughs> when this video. When this video over, she finna tweak something on this cam on this on this. She lighting. ain't telling that one lie because I'm sitting here thinking about it now, trying to figure it out. Is it the? Do I need to change this? Do I need to bring this back down? Because I brought this up, but y'all get the point of what we saying, man. We didn't mean to take over their video, y'all, but he this is why we need a podcast. We just don't have the time for. It. We cannot add anything else to our schedule right now. We can't add anything nah, else to our look, schedule I'm right here now. Like, can we though? No, but no, we can't. No, we can't. We can't. But when we get the time, a podcast will be coming because I really feel like, I really I, feel yeah, like, we got a lot of good stuff to say. Yeah, yeah, but we are gonna give these folks their video back. Okay. Said okay, yeah. cool. We saw, I understand yeah. that these thousand Kanye songs from stuff. 2018 probably will never come out. <laughs> yeah, that's okay. Wow. I'm building up the muscle and getting my reps in so that when it does come time to drop my own song, it can go platinum. So mm. what you're saying is, when you get started with whatever your, your dream or your passion is, yep. you have to be willing and ready to weather the storm yep. of people not giving a damn for a minute, just building the muscle. Do you know how many people are like probably 10 to 20 more songs away from making a life-changing hit? And then they're gonna drop out and say, it's not for me. And they're right there. They're right there. If they had just stayed in for like another week, they would have had it. Right? This, we're going to call this a season of faith. I, I want to pause this, this video so bad. I don't know okay. in what order these episodes Somebody are going to come out. But, getting but if it's... I'm getting the Holy Somebody Ghost. Getting I'm getting the Holy, the Holy Ghost. Ghost. Because, <laughs> because mm. when I was sitting on this flow trying to figure out how to make us fit behind his desk. <laughs> Right before we started this video, baby, I was sitting here like, this shit ain't worth all this. Because I deal with all the technical stuff. Yeah. I deal with all the tech stuff. Baby deal with all the emails and comments she deal with comments. I deal with comments too, you know what I'm saying? But she makes sure I ain't mess around and schedule videos for the same time. And mm -hmm. I deal with everything else. I deal with the camera, the because I that techie stuff the microphones I do all the research if we need to upgrade something I'm the one doing the research trying to figure out if this is the right thing to go for I deal with all that y'all that shit is stressful yeah and right before we started this video but I was sitting here fighting the urge of saying fuck I was so close to being like fuck it I'm not doing reactions no more because it's a lot to go into it and when stuff goes wrong when stuff goes wrong after you fix something else that go oh, that yeah. just went wrong. Oh yeah. But the funny thing is that I already knew. Like this this is how being four going on five years of being together, how you know your mate. Because I seen her sitting on this floor and I knew she was ready. I knew she was ready to say F it. I knew she was ready to say F it. But my thing is is and maybe probably be probably be like Baby, see me over here frustrated and blah, blah, blah. That's because baby ain't always going to be around to bring you down off of that. You have to, you know, so I, you know, after a while, she, she'll let her get her frustrations out. Because she know if she say F and I don't want to do this, 
tomorrow she gonna be ready to do it again sometimes you i'm just sitting gotta... here trying to figure out my own reaction channel yeah i want my own reaction channel too as well and i don't know what to react to but drop her some ideas if y'all yeah. know any. drop me some ideas i don't i don't think i want to react to like no couples and nothing like that but but yeah just it's i had to... it's a hard thing to know we done turned this episode into a whole podcast we did but it's all right because the thing is somebody need what somebody exactly. need this blessing the thing like he said is like somebody is 10 20 songs away from making it the thing is is this the stat day that you and that's how i think about it today i feel like saying f it i'm tired of it i don't feel like doing it i'm just sick of it but what if tomorrow is the day that everything goes how it's supposed to how you want it to go like how you manifest, how you've been manifesting it to go. So why would mm-hmm. you give up today? And then if tomorrow come, what if it's the next day? Like you just don't know. So the point of giving up just is like, but you also don't know. Like, is this a sign that I should give up? Baby, God just put a gospel song on my heart. You finna write a song? I'm not finna. No, oh. it's a song that's already written. <laughs> I'm bad. not finna sing it either. I'm sorry. But if you know gospel, if you know old school gospel do you know the song that say i almost i'm not gonna sing it because i'm not a singer but it say i almost let go i felt like i just couldn't take life anymore my problems had me bound the pressure i can't remember all the words Mm -hmm. y'all but that's how the song go. Like, I'm going to listen to that song when I get done because I'm still up there and I, I need to come on back down. Yeah. But I'm telling y'all, man, sometimes you just have to hold on a little longer. That's all. Because on. before we hit that thousand subscribers, y'all, it was going real slow. It was. It was going slow. I was... I'm also the one who figure out the videos because I, I, I do a lot of watching YouTube, you know what I'm saying? And I be on the internet more than baby do. So I kind of know what's going on a little bit more. So I deal with the technology and I try to figure out what we're going to react to and all this other stuff. But that's besides the point. But um, I forgot what I was about to say. I got <laughs> so much. on. I got so much going on in my head. It's just. But yeah, man, like you just have to hold on. Because when those subscribers was growing slow, I kept trying to figure it out. I kept trying to figure it out. I'm like, dang, we ain't getting nowhere. Next thing you know, every morning we woke up, we had Mm -hmm. this many subscribers. We had this many subscribers. Y'all, when we hit a thousand, it was like we was we was shocked even though we saw it coming. Right. Because at the same time we didn't believe it. And we was about I was about to give up. I really was. I was about to give up. And I didn't, you know what I'm saying? I think I'm learning that too. Cause you know, when stuff don't go, being a perfectionist, when stuff don't go how you want it to go, you ready to throw in the towel and like, fuck it. I don't even want to do it mm-hmm. because I done did that so many times. I done started so much stuff. And then when it wasn't going as fast as I wanted it to, or how I wanted it to, I threw the towel in, you know what I'm saying? I even told baby one time, well, if I do this, ain't nobody going to take me serious. Cause look how much stuff I done started. I done put out into the world and then I didn't carry it through. You know what I'm saying? So when I saw that, it was just like, like when we seen the thousand subscribers, we was like, oh yeah, we're going to keep going. Mm-hmm. But had we had gave up when them subscriber numbers was not going the way we wanted mm-hmm. it to. We would not be here right now. We would not be here right now. And I'm sorry again that we have turned this into a podcast okay, episode. Okay, because video was 26 minutes. And, and it is 43. Mm-hmm. Okay, let's get it. We, let's Bless baby. y'all for listening. We sorry, y'all, but when God be putting stuff on our heart to say, Ooh. we we have to say it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Like we can talk about it after the video, but that doesn't serve it's the not purpose. Hit the same. It don't serve the purpose. We have to say it when we have to say it because that's when it's clear. You yeah. know what I'm saying? That's when the full sentence is there. And for something like this type of stuff, and it depends on the type of stuff. When when we like when we do stop a video to talk like this, it it's not no nonsense stuff. Yeah, it's some real life stuff that because it's not often where we talk where we stop a video and have a full conversation exactly and in my heart i feel like especially with a conversation like this and everything that's going on like in my Mm -hmm. heart i truly feel like 
somebody is going to watch this video and they're going to need this word and they is going to hear what we said and what he said and it is going to put them in a different place yeah they're going to jump up they're going to be ready to jump up and 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 start over exactly and i if if we could change somebody's life just from what we're saying we're gonna do that i'm gonna do it so if your mad, life don't need changing if you don't need this message by all means click out the video but honey, somebody needed this somebody watched this video mm-hmm. to the end just to see what else we had to say because yeah. they feeling just like how i'm feeling how mm-hmm. i was feeling how i'm still feeling right now you know what i'm saying stuff can get so heavy y'all we be ready to drop it we be ready to life let it go and we be so close to changing our own life you know what i'm saying majority of the problems that we go through y'all we put ourselves through them yep and we be ready to let go over something that we don't have no control over yeah the next thing you start you're not gonna have control over that yep you gonna you only got so much control everything else is up to god the universe whoever you believe in mm-hmm. you know what i'm saying if that's how it's supposed to go it's gonna go Thanks. if that's not how it's supposed to go go back to the drawing board and start over Thanks. but it's not the end of the world nope i need to get that tatted so i can remind myself every day that it's not the end of the world because i can be a little dramatic sometimes too early when i will say it it's <laughs> cool um but that's what that's really you're what it always, is always almost Ooh, right sorry, there you're almost when you're about to give up right when you think you're about to give up that's yeah. exactly when you're close that's when you mm. know you're close 11 seconds on the clock the word is can't okay mm-hmm. mm. can't oh uh no 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 we can't be friends the tray the tray the tray the classic tray song i had another tray song what'd you have oh, uh i can't help but wait Oh yeah, well that's, yeah. that's true. He's, just, we just both thought of Trey songs. He says can't a lot. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna need you to take that one out of your vocabulary, sir. You can do anything. <laughs> All this can't cry, cry. There's a million cries. There's a million cries. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, uh, cry me a river. Cry me a river. Oh, cry me a river. Cry me a river. Oh, yes. <laughs> There's a little something, a little bit of that. Did I pass? I got it in under the buzzer. <laughs> when was the buzzer? <laughs> Am I late? He's adorable! I'm late. I huh? can't stand it. Am I late? Yeah. Roxy's you late. like, you're late and you've been late. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just on CPT. Do I'm not sing? really late. I'm going to let you sing any song that you like, okay? Uh-huh. A song that maybe has been in your head over the last couple of days. Mm. It could be an OD. It could be one of yours. Whatever you mm. want. You make my soul a burning fire. Uh! You're getting to be my one desire. You're getting to be all that matters to me. Oh, let me tell you, girl, I hope and pray each day I live. A little more love I have to give. A little more love that's devoted and true. Cause all I do is think about you. All I do mm, is think about you. Oh, all I do <laughs> is think about you. Hello, you know, hello, hello. I have to clap for that. We clap for Stevie. We clap for Stevie. When I had you, look, I treated you bad. Yeah, let me be great. You're wrong, my dear. But since since you've been away, don't you know I? Sit around with my head hanging down, and I wonder who's loving you. Mile is the word. Mile, I have a song. I know. I have a song out right now. Uh huh. Uh-huh. Tell me. You keep putting miles, mm. miles, miles on my heart. You keep putting miles. Miles, yes. Miles, oh my! 
and I'm loving it, baby. Mm. <laughs> there is a group of young black artists mm -hmm. who are breaking in to the country music scene. Country music has an undeniably black beginning. The origins of country music don't exist without black culture. So when people are like, why are you making country music? Let's be, let's be honest, we started this, right? The banjo and the, like that's all, it's all stems from black culture, right? And in the 50s and 60s, there were some black country artists and then there was a shift mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. away from it mm -hmm. and the industry got very, Talk about it. Mm, monochromatic. Okay, he, I would have said it differently, but you understand. Right? There are a lot of songs that I would consider country songs that we probably wouldn't consider country songs. Like what? There are some songs, okay, Rihanna had several on her album, on mm. the anti-album that I felt like were country songs. That Love on the Brain, to okay. Close to You, yes. um, Higher. This whiskey got me feeling pretty. Apologize. So sorry if I'm impolite. <laughs> yeah. Tell me about the new single. The new single is called Cross Country. Yes. Uh, I'm really excited about this one. This song, yeah. uh, it's it's just like, it's, it's autobiographical. Yeah. It tells my story. Um, as a young black man in the country music mm. space, mm -hmm. Uh, I think that my story is significant. Yeah. And everyone's story is significant. Let's yeah. be honest, everyone's story is significant. But I think that for the people who are in at this intersection of country and, and black, yeah. yes, country and blackness, mm. we are doing something that I think has the potential to unite a lot of people on different sides of a lot of issues, right? Because music is one of the only things that we have. Yeah on this planet that unites people. Yeah, it's universal. It's yes. universal. I think that it's time for us to drop some of these genre lines that we have drawn unnecessarily and drop some of these boundaries and barriers to entry that we have in some yes. of these genres to say, hey, it's music. Y'all, y'all didn't went to church today. Uh -huh. You went yeah. to homophone school today. Mm -hmm. yeah, we wrote a, a hook. And you got a sermon from Stacey the Lord. and Asia. Lord. Almost on this song. We wrote a hook Amen. on here. Songwriting class today. I mean, I may have failed the song association, <laughs> but I don't think so. I did pass the bar exam. You dig? Yeah. You dig? Okay. <laughs> All right. <laughs> well, I'll take a lap. I'm sorry. Roxy, how do you feel? Fulfilled. Yes. Fulfilled. The destiny has been fulfilled. Ah. Uh, I agree with that. I love it. I love I, it. I. Can I wait to see whatever you have coming up next? Y'all, please go and stream um, the new single. Cross, Cross Country. Country. Cross it's Country. out everywhere. Check it out. Check it out. While y'all do that, I am going to go watch basketball so I can yeah, learn. Yeah, so you can catch up. What the hell a point guard does? Because <laughs> apparently you. they do a lot. They do a lot. Okay? I don't know nothing about it. Is Ben Simmons a point guard? He is. Really? He is. He's a point guard. My husband's a point guard. I should know this. And, and, and he plays for my team. He plays my favorite team, the Philly. Sixers. Philly. Yeah. So you already Sixers. know. South Jersey Redmond. So yeah. yeah. I didn't even know that part. We in just there. fine to me. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, y'all? This is Breland, and I just had a blast on the Terrell Show. Yes. We talked about a lot of great stuff. Make sure you like, subscribe, and comment for my boy. He's fantastic. And uh, I've got a new single out, Cross Country, and some new music on the way. Be sure to check that out, too. I love him. Don't leave me, please. <laughs> <laughs> this has to be one of my favorite episodes. Probably. Yeah, I, I'll give it that. His energy <clears throat> is amazing. Yeah. Amazing, man. His energy is amazing. Oh, yeah. I cannot wait to react to Molly music. I love his music. Um, Yes, his energy is amazing kind of threw me off with the Molly music part. I, had I no did that the last time on. I seen it on there. What? Yeah, because remember I had to tell you what song I was talking about. Oh. I don't remember who re who video it was, but yeah, it was at the okay. end. Okay, I remember now. Yeah. But if you haven't seen our other reactions to The Terrell Show, make sure you go to our channel. Check out The Terrell Show playlist. It will be under the playlist category. Every Terrell Show that we have reacted to will be right up under there. If you're a T and Coco fan, Make sure you check out that T and Coco uh, playlist. playlist. And make sure you uh, hit that like button, comment, and subscribe. Share and hit the post notifications so you know every time we drop a new video. Peace.